all right so uh this is the second part of the the charity uh but hey it's gonna be something very random but i figured you know it's it's saturday for me and it's a little late so it's saturday for some people too so technically not a real spooky saturday or anything like that but hey this is something fun it's called the dread collection and it's kind of like the haunted playstation one collection a little bit except it's not necessarily retro games or D makes or in that playstation one style that we also are so spooked by but uh, yes but what we're gonna be doing is the haunted not the haunted excuse me <clears throat> the dread x collection uh, this is the dread x collection 2 there's around five of these and it's a bunch of games um and i hope it's not like chain well actually chain was kind of cool if you didn't see that stream chain was a collection of games that i had an idea and then that idea carried over to the next game and that you know, like it's a game of telephone gameplay wise uh except most of them weren't like that great but i'm not sure what is different here but we're gonna give it a little try chain is more like an aesthetic yeah well we're gonna give it a try see what it's all about i know about one thing about this game that cracked me up there's a game in this collection that was made by the guy who made dusk because uh, the iron lung stuff was really fun and i haven't really played dusk that much played a demo of it many years ago but he also made a game about where you like stapled squirrels as a hunter they're gonna give that a try and see what it's all about uh, it's called squirrel stapler yes that's what it's called yes well here we go here's the second in the collection uh setting is this meant to be in this resolution i don't think it is no it, it is all like no here it is here it is that's that's what we want, want it to look like subtitles on yes by default please all right well here we go guys uh dread collection free play start game i don't know anything about this but swearing Oh, it's my controller doing this. Hang on. Sorry. I was wondering, what the fuck is that? I won't beat around the bush. Bad news. You are infected. Oh. It must have happened during the last testing cycle. The protocol should have been enough to prevent contagious exposure, but, well, maybe those were all... What a weird graphic. It's like high def, but not really. That is a key. Okay. E. Okay. Oh. Uh, good. You're still able to follow simple commands, and well, your legs still work. Uh, ah. All good signs. Now for the harder part. We are going to have to give you a cognitive kick. Mm. Um, that should be enough to jumpstart your your natural neural defense mechanisms. In okay. circumstances, we'd be able to just recontextualize your inlaid traumas and, and reintroduce them as false memories through neural implanting, but that's not an option anymore. Uh, so I, uh, well, improvised. See those VHS tapes uh, locked up around you? Use that key to open up one. Uh, oh. Just pop that bad boy into the VCR Pop that bad boy in. All right, well, here's the collection, but you just pick something. So I saw a little bit of a screenshot of the um, squirrel game. Which one is that? Oh, we got a dev in chat. No way. Torpal Duke. Hang on. Hey, I'm one of the devs of these games and Earl stay off. Thanks for playing. I told the rest of the devs to come back to come check you out. Well, oh my God. Earl stay off. Wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Earl, stay off. Is that that fishing game? Because I, I, your name is very familiar. I played that, and the other developer was here for that, Torpal. And we 
okay, if you missed that, the other developer was here for that, and we were like, my god, this game is amazing. And at the end of the game, like, the developer showed up, and I'm like, can you modify this game? And like, you know, we were just like, bullshitting around, right? And he sent me a, like, a special edition of it. I was the one who modified the game while listening to Flintstones. I was the one who modded mod the game. So, 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 but, but, but hang on, wait, wait a minute. Torpal Luke, it, it, that's you? But Torpal, Torpal, I know you. You don't have to tell me. Like, hey, I'm, I did one of the games. I know you. You're, I'm not that forgetful, you know. T you're that guy. <laughs> I was like, hey, wait a minute. I know Torpal, you know. Well, that's funny. That's, that's, you know, you're that guy. Yeah, but we, we, unless it's something's new to it, you know. That might be Earl's Day Off. I'm, I'm not sure, but, uh, you know. You're that Devin? Well, I'll tell you what, we might give it another try, I suppose. But for now, I want to give that, like, squirrel stapler game a try. Whatever it is. Here we go. You can't leave, not yet. First, grab the key on the television, use some of the VHS lockbox, and play the tape. If you When, when it ejects, I'll unbar the door. I'm a long-time stream watcher, very excited you're playing our games. Oh, well, I appreciate you guys coming around, but... Uh, yeah, I remember last time we played, and I believe it's Earl's Day Off, yes. Unless it's different this time, man. You have to play your personalized copy of Earl's, you know. Is this the one? Here's Squirrel Stapler, yes. Squirrel Stapler by David Zeranski. Hunt squirrels, staple them to a corpse. Meet God. Okay, th this this key that says unlock the tape is very roller coaster, no, theme park world esque. But meet God, right. Uh, off we go. Press inventory to view. Okay. Squirrel stapler. All right. Well, let's try it. Is this going to launch in the same window? If it does, I'm going to be super impressed. Or if it's going to be a, like a new window opening. No, no, no. No game can figure out how to do that properly, which is kind of a shame. But, nah. And unfortunately, this game launches in giant window. I wish there was some way to like integrate the one in the same, but I don't think that is possible. But hey, anyway, here's Squirrel Stapler. Interactive small game hunting. Controls. It's your standard. Oh god, okay. I saw a screenshot of this game, that's why I wanted to play it. And it's like one of the ugliest games ever made. We came here to get away from it all. <laughs> So, wait, 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 wait. look at my beloved. The flies have made her ugly and rotten. What the fuck? I wish it were beautiful. I like the squirrels of the wood. And so I will cover her in the squirrels of the wood. Ah. Uh, my, my wife turned into ground beef, and now I'm gonna... Wait, I'm gonna squ staple squirrels to her? Okay, I don't. I, I didn't know what the premise of this game was. I'm like squirrel stapler, and I saw somebody hunt. I'm like, all right, but oh, great! No, saith the goat of the wood, thou shalt not staple squirrels. You can't tell me what to do. Okay, where's like the door? <laughs> oh, there it is. <laughs> oh boy, the bit rate's gonna go to crap after I do this, but hey, it's fine. Huh? Is it just me that see two eyeballs on the <laughs> on the plates? <laughs> like some real car stuff? You know. Um, this is made by the Dusk and Iron Lung Dev. Yes. Yes, I know. In five days, God is coming. Ooh, we better clean out. Day one! What the fuck? It's time to hunt the squirrels. Poison grass do not eat. There's a raccoon, isn't it? Oh, oh, okay. It really is one of the ugliest games I've ever seen in my life. Tip of the day, use the map default tab or to orient yourself. Come back come back tomorrow for another tip. Because that's me at the bottom. Alright. 
not innate squirrel hunting tips. Running is loud and can scare squirrels away before you even see them. Walk whenever possible. Stay low with the full control to hide in the fo foliage and creep quietly. You're practically undetectable if you hide in the weeds. Use your ears. You can usually hear squirrels shattering and moving before you can see them. Your rifle is equipped with a scope. Use it to bag varmints at long range. Okay. Alright, well, let's hunt some squirrels. Tip of the day. All right, well, uh, I would say, like, my god, these graphics suck, but I think that's kind of the point. <laughs> okay, are they up in the trees? When I was, uh, like, when I was, like, 14, 13 or whatever, I was walking early in the morning, and I saw a squirrel on a twig near a tree, and we were, like, half a meter away from it, and we just, like, locked, and we're like, huh. Stared at each other, and I didn't have my phone on me, so I, you know, would have been like shitty phones back then. But you know, it's like my God, I need to capture this, and I can only remember it. I had a moment with a squirrel, man. Okay. Hmm. God, when I do these hunting game streams, it's always like the entire stream is like six hours of nothing, and suddenly something comes along, and I shoot it, and it's just like missed. <laughs> okay, actually, I played so much Iron Lung that now that I'm playing this, um, I'm like, oh, there's not going to be any knowledge of where I am, but this is different. Like Danny DeVito and that one rabbit on Sunny? Yes, 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 like that. Rabbit's got my soul. Okay. Nothing yet. Okay, okay, I, I have a sneaking suspicion that these rabbits, not these rabbits, squirrels, is going to be a man in a suit with an axe chasing after me at night. Or something like that. There's a health thing over there, which, you know, I think that's health at least. Joel, this isn't puppet combo. Well, you never know. <gasps> What's that? Wait, wait, wait. I saw, wait, wait. No, that's not a squirrel here. Yeah. Hmm. Goodness, the bitrate is dying. Yeah, this game has that crust factor to it on the graphics. It makes everything kind of muddy and, like, weird. But it's, you know, hey. Squirrel fact. Squirrels use their tails for many things, including for balance and as parachute and as a parachute for f when falling. Did you know that, guys? Did you know that? Did you know that animals use their tail not just to mess around? Hey, wait a minute. I heard something. We gotta crash a little bit. I hunt squirrels. Who hunts squirrels? I guess this guy. Oh. Oh. They up in the trees. Hmm. Hang on. Hang on now. Starving people. Dude, you can eat grass, right? You can eat grass. You wouldn't need to, uh... Oh, 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 oh that, that, that's the squirrel. Oh, no, he's ugly. <laughs> oh, he's terrible. Oh, no. Oh, he's so ugly. Oh, there he goes. Oh, I don't want to shoot him. He's... I mean, he's giant. Oh, no. Oh, damn it. And that's a raccoon. That's not a squirrel. My god. My god. Uh, okay, well. Oh, I think I hear another. Oh. But you don't just sneak up on them. They're like. Look, look, look. Unless they're gonna like bolt. Oh, oh, oh okay. Hang on, hang on. Oh, you gotta. Okay, you gotta do that, huh? Huh. Joel hates raccoons. No, I, I love raccoons. It just happens that these are squirrels. Raccoons are ugly squirrels. No, 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 no. Okay. Oh. Oh, oh. Is that the one? Is that the one? Guy right here? <laughs> yeah, he's bolting. Hang on, hang on, hang on. You know what I don't like? I don't like the fact that when I'm doing this, it says squirrel. You know, when I'm hovering over him? 
That means at some point I'm gonna look at something and you know what it's gonna say? Satan. All right. Nah. <laughs> nah. What is there something here? Is that my house? That is my house. Well, how many squirrels do I need? Hang on. I guess we go back and... I need to finish hunting before I go back inside. Oh, how many? Oh, wait, I see it down at the bottom right. It's two. Two. Okay. <laughs> it literally says on the bottom right. Hey, we got a German raid. Uh, hello, dear German viewers. Uh, I'm sure you missed it, but... Jerma literally came to my school. No, I meant, uh, Jerma... <laughs> Jerma... <laughs> Jerma went on the stream, uh, in the game called Vargverse, and he got beaten by a tuna. So, uh, <laughs> to rephrase that. So, uh, yes, hello dear viewers of Jerma. How was Jerma anyway? Was he doing good? Doing alright? <laughs> what was he streaming? What was he streaming? Okay. German was dying. Oh. He was streaming. He was doing a sponsored stream. He was doing a sponsored stream. What, what was he playing? Okay, I'm looking for these goddamn squirrels at this point. Serpent Rogue. Okay. Well, li listen, here's what we're gonna do, right? Jerma doesn't need to, like, s play sponsored games. If he wants, I can slip him $5, okay? He doesn't need to reduce himself to... <laughs> okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. No, no, it's it's okay. He can, he, he can do whatever he wants. I know that, like... Jerma, unlike me, gives a fuck about what he does, and when he he's, you know, riding hot air balloons, and he's doing, like, you know, jumping through broken glass, like, that is probably gonna cost five million dollars, and let me tell you something, that is, requires a lot. Can I shoot this raccoon? No, it's a squirrel, twice. No, okay, okay. It means I have one more! Okay, yeah. Tell the German viewers about the charity. Yes, yes, German viewers. Uh, on, a, on a more serious note, uh, we're doing a bit of a charity stream here for... Uh, we streamed a Vargverse earlier, which literally had German in it, if you want to, like, watch the VOD afterwards or, like, rewind. But uh, one of the things that we're doing right now, we're doing a uh, direct relief. If you want, spare a dollar for that. Um... But uh, yeah, I want to. I, also, I can't talk. I also want to say a big thank you to Mike for helping out and like organizing this event. You know, Mike is really the brains here. I'm happy to just be here and help out with it. But uh, you know, it, it's 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 much more charity. That's what. Sorry, I got the command wrong. There we go. Man. All right. But anyway, uh, let's see here. I'm a little, a little uh, worried about the command, or the, the the thing that said meet God in this game. But you know, we'll, we'll see what it's all about. Okay, yeah. What was isn't that like a squirrel call? You go like, like in your cheek. Isn't that how you like attract squirrels? You know how. Squirrels have four sharp toes on their front feet for climbing, and did did five toes on their back feet. <laughs> Don't stop running. Yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, I'll, I'll sneak around. That's how you attract me, Joel. Can somebody mod that person and then ban him? <laughs> okay. <laughs> but hang on, I should be able to see like the squirrel here. Because here's an old hunting game technique, right? If you play a game like this, right-click, zoom in, and if any graphic is moving, that's the thing to shoot at, right? That's like the monster, you know? Watch out for that. Okay, hang on, hang on now. It's a little bit of ammo here. Is that a health bar in the bottom left? Yes. So at some point, this game is gonna go bonkers. 
Speaking of bonkers, did you know in New York there's like a city called Yonkers? <laughs> I kept doing a double take reading that. There's... Oh, 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 oh. And I, anyone here from Yonkers? <laughs> oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, you fucker, I didn't reload my gun. Okay. Yonkers. Is, am I saying that right? Yonkers. Oh my god, literally the other day in New York City, my friend was making fun of Yonkers. What does that mean, Yonkers? Maybe you don't pronounce it that way. Yonkers. Hey, Joey, get a fucking pizza, fucking pizza, shit pizza, down a fucking... Joey Yonk Yonkers. <laughs> what is that? What is that? What is that strip club uh, food chain in America? Uh, honkers? No, that's Hooters. No, fuck. I was gonna say, hey, we're gonna go down to Yonkers and go to hon Honkers. <laughs> then we're gonna get fizzy with the glizzy. That's because my English is deteriorating at a rapid rate. It's not a strip club, but it's like, you know, I, I, I read a news article about Hooters used to have their own airplane. And these like, uh, these ladies would like, like go around the plane in like skimpy clothing and like, you know what I'm talking about? Okay. Oh, 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 I got him. I got him. There we go. Uh, squirrel facts. Squirrels use their tails for many things. Okay, but we already got that. It was an entire airline. Right, 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 right. There it is. All right. There are enough squirrels for today. All right, let's head south here and head back. I should head back home. Opinion of Cruelty Squad. This game's graphics remind me of it. I wanted to give Cruelty Squad a try. Uh, in fact, the developer was giving out keys, and I was going to stream it, but... I generally feel a little weird about get, getting stream keys, because I'm like, do I have to be nice now? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, if somebody gives me something for free, you know, it's like common sense. You don't say like, you know, this 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 potato dish tastes like pussy. Yo, your spaghetti sucks dick, bro. Like, you, you gotta be like, it's not great. <laughs> you know? I don't know. Oh, so it's delicious. Yo, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Your fucking burgers can gut my insides like a pumpkin. Alright? Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, buddy. You split me like a coconut. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Your lasagna makes my throat pussy queef. Alright, it is choice. Okay, I'll stop talking. Cut the mic. Cut the mic. <laughs> You're like a dirtier germa. Are you saying that I don't wash my genitals? Okay. Stop it. Blading the viewers. Okay, anyway, let's see here. Um, okay, we got that now, so let's head back and see what we got in here. Uh, in five days, in five days, God is coming. Okay, there's gonna be something horrible at the end of this. I have a feeling. Okay, we got that already. <laughs> God is coming. All right, well, let's head inside and check out what's going on. Press action, default left button, to staple the squirrels to your beloved. Ah! Ooh! Ha ha! Ooh! Ah. Uh. You know, this game did not bullshit around. The game was called Squirrel Stapler, and... You know. Oh, sleepy time! <laughs> Time to sleep. Etc. You are sleeping. <laughs> what the fuck? All right. Uh, that's that's me book it. Okay. Uh right. <laughs> New desktop wallpaper. 
I've never seen a sleep jump scare. What do you have now? In five days, God is coming. All right. Hmm. Day two. All right. There's something else now. I think there's a really big squirrel this time around. Check that out. There's an XL squirrel, and then there's five small ones. Okay. I can only imagine what <laughs> what's going through the minds of German viewers who don't know Joel right now. Jeremy and I have collaborated before. We played uh, Halo, <clears throat> and we also played uh, Keep Talking and No One Explodes. Um, I would rather check out that stream rather than Halo, because that Halo stream is, is, is a little bad. But, you know, but please, by all means. You missed free squirrels? What are you talking about? What do you mean, free squirrels? I love that stream. Dude, I, I when I stream with Jerma, <laughs> I, I think I, I talked to him afterwards. I'm like, that stream sucked ass. It's like, no, it was good. <laughs> like, well, yeah. Okay. Here we go. All right, so this is two dead... Wait a minute, there are two dead squirrels here. What the hell? What happened here? Poison grass. Oh, I see. Oh, you just get free squirrels that eat poison grass. I, po I thought poison grass was just, like, astroturf. No, that's like plastic, right? When you stream together, your IQs subtract. Okay. I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> Microplastic. It is, it is poison. It's astroturf plastic. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I think... Either that is a squirrel or it's a page. It's a page, yeah. Okay. What the fuck do you mean with God is coming? Alright. A squirrel fact. All the squirrels mostly eat nuts, seeds, and fruit. They have been known to eat insects, bird eggs, and even animal carcasses. Right. Guys, we're learning on my streams. You learn things on my stream now. <laughs> Alright. A squirrel hunt. I have a question. Is it really true that, that like, like American hillbillies actually eat roadkill? Or is that some sort of, like, vast urban legend? Yes. It's true. So, so, like, some, some squirrel is, like, with a Hanna-Barbera sound effect going beep, 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 out on the, um, you know, the main road in Arizona. <laughs> So some, some, like, hillbilly with, like, one eyeball takes a spatula and goes and just, like, puts it in a frying pan, you know? It, that, that's what that is. Squirrel fact. A male squirrel can smell a female in heat from up to a mile away. A joel can smell a germa in heat from up to a mile away. Okay, yeah. They gotta cool off. <laughs> I like this one person's response in chat. It was just like 15 exclamation marks and like 12 question marks. Like, what? What are you saying? Stop it. <laughs> Cut this Mikey. Okay, let's assess the situation here. Huh? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> I like that comment. Stop, but it's like six, seven question marks. So they're not sure if they're like this person that's demanding me to stop. It's more so like, stop? Okay, hang on, hang on. It's another page over here, but... Hang on, I think I hear a squirrel somewhere. There's also a, a El Gigante squirrel. What is squirrel in Spanish, guys? Just curious. Small abnormal readings still occur with odd regularity. Recalibrating always fixes them. No, it's not El Squirrel, fuck off. El Squirrel, no. They can El Rato, fuck off. El Squirrel. 
Okay, don't make me don't make me go on Google and translate to find this out. El squirrel, el grey rato, squid, el squirrel, bitch. Okay, listen, listen, I might be a fucking idiot, but I'm not gonna go to like a Spanish national park and be like, yes, there are some very nice bitches around. <laughs> These bitches have big, big nuts in the mouth. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Shut up! <laughs> okay, it looks like maybe an animal is leaving them. Okay, yeah. They also keep finding dead squirrels outside the door, but I'm noticing it. Okay, come back for support. Okay. Oh, let me guess. It's radioactive. Radioactivity has caused a mutant squirrel to grow to the size of, you know, a man. And at the end of the game, God is going to be... A man in a suit, chasing after me. Okay, hang on, hang on now. Ah, right in the asshole. Okay, yeah. not bad though. All right, that means two more Erme now. Okay. It's Ardia? Is that it the thing? Okay. Yes. Notice that I took extra care not say Ardilla. Okay. Ah, yes. Let me get some carne asada with my tortilla. And get some salsa on these nuts. Sweet rally. Oh, oh what the fuck? Okay, don't step inside the the stone age. What the hell? All, all right. To evil of stone age. Did I reload my gun? I don't want to like press F to call scrolls. Oh, you can actually do that. Okay. How am I making this noise? It's like an impossible noise. <laughs> okay. There we go. With your butt tools. Okay. Okay, look at that mountain. See that mountain? You can take a promenade over it. Chewing on a dog toy. Okay, okay, you, you, okay, yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay. That's cool. We have a, we had a bit of a Marco Polo thing going on. Okay, yeah. Press your teeth against your lower lips and suck on it to make the noise. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Can I double down? Okay, nailed it. Streamer chokes to death because of chatter. Oh, that that was a super squirrel. Okay. Oh, hang on. That's a bird. Joel has no teeth as he is old. As he is old. Excuse you. Maybe if I stand tall on this mountain, you know, that'll give me more of a. Hang on. Hang on. This one over here. Okay. It's generally a good idea to have like a high. S oh, hang on. Wait, 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 wait. Nailed it. Look at that. Suck the air, don't blow it. <laughs> I'm not doing that noise again. Okay, thank you. <laughs> no, that that ain't right. 
The Lady Part 2. The artist was inconsolable and spent his days weeping and taking his portrait on long walks in the rain. One of these old walks, he encountered an old woman who said, Ah, ah, young man, I can see the reason for your despair. Come with me. For a few pennies, she said, his treasured painting could be brought to life. The artist was overjoyed and the spell was cursed. Only then did he remember that he had only painted the woman from the waist up. Okay, she got this... Okay. A random ass story. Okay. Okay, there's one over there. Okay. See, the problem with these games is that when you're playing a game like this, there's gonna be one objective left and it's gonna be anywhere on the map. You know, and you just can't fucking find it. So welcome to the next 45 minutes of this stream, everybody. I hope I don't bore the shit out of you because it's gonna be a lot of nothing. Okay. Yay. Hang on. If I get a little bit of a callback, you know, I mean, that mill will know what happens. Hang on. Oh. You guys hear that? Be like a jump scare place. Uh, this game hasn't deserved it yet. <laughs> Fuck off. It's up in the trees. Uh. Nope, I found you. Oh, he's not dead. Oh, he's coming. He's coming this way. Uh, uh. Oh, I got him. I got him. I got him. No, I wasn't scared by the squirrel. The noise caught me. All right. Uh. All right, cool. And we got that. Let's head on home. I should head back home. Mm. The squirrel noise. You know, this game is played on the daylight, but you just know for a matter of fact that the moment this goes to night, it goes to shit. Okay. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be quaking in my boots. Okay. Mm -mm. Oh man. Hey, Joey, it's your neighbors. Please stop making swirl noises. It's keeping me away. By the way, I will can smell the repulsive stench of the piece of a man who only drinks Monster and Mug whenever you go to the bathroom. Please eat healthy. We're worried about you. Is that why you moved yesterday? <laughs> okay. Here we go. <laughs> yes. All right. Well, here we go. Uh... Oh yeah, I gotta go in here, right? <laughs> Time to staple squirrels. Okay, I don't want to wait squirrels. I want s I want skin. Give me back my skin. Or give me yours instead. Too bad. Squirrel time. Time to sleep. You are sleeping. <laughs> Can you imagine showing this game to someone who, like, do, does not get it, video games at all? Like, their perception of a video game is like Atari beep, 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 stuff, right? And you're like, this is video games in 2022, and it's like, oh, really? I mean, the video games don't look better? Like, this is this is the best, you know? Okay, well... Uh, okay, this is a sort of incantation room, uh, you know? Uh, Oh man, send this game back to 1985. Yeah, yeah, but I would do that, and it'd be like, "Yo, fix these graphics, dog." <laughs> oh, Please. Something was scratching the windows last night. I should look for tracks. Oh Jesus, what is this now? Okay. Some scratching on the windows. What are you talking about? Oh. These are not normal squirrel tracks. I told you, I told you it'd be some weird... Something out there is hunting me. Oh, oh. What the fuck? Wh what? 
Excuse me? That was a bomb chew from like Zelda. What the fuck was that? Okay, the horror just dropped and it's just... What, what the fuck? Meat creeper, what the fuck? Okay, guys, we gotta be real quiet this time, huh? Okay, so that's why you have a health bar, huh? <laughs> horror. Are you playing with the lights off, Joey? Uh, I am not. I have my window open. You know, but, you know, the mailman can scare me. Okay, squirrel, squirrel acquired. We have three more. But what's that anyway? It's some big ass, big ass dude. Oh, 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 hang on. Is that the sound of another squirrel or is it like birds? Hang on, hang on. Watch the health. Yeah, but yeah, I gotta get more health. <gasps> oh, 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 I see him, I see him, I see him. Hang on, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Such a great shot, such a great shot. Okay, not bad, not bad. Also, I don't think there's bullet drop in this game. I hear something else. I think. Guess I have one bullet left. I have to make this count. Okay. I saw you. I saw you. I saw you. Can't run, man. Oh! oh! <laughs> Fuck off! Fuck off! That should not scare me! It's just some little boingy boof dude coming around. Alright. One more bullet, actually. Uh, I need to get more. Yeah, I mean, squirrel. Squirrel comedy. Squirrel jumps empty. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> Scared of small animals. Dude, I was watching this, like, thing from India. It was this giant cobra thing, and this guy just, like, took this guy, this guy, this cobra out by his hands, carried him out, and just, like, threw him out, like, hey, get that fuck out of here. Like, this cobra was larger than the dude, you know? I guess, I guess at that point, it's no longer like a small animal, but you know what I mean. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. We got ammo here. Anything here? Nope. Okay, okay, watch out for the stone inge. It'll hurt you. For now, we gotta get a med kit, I think. You know what? He threw Cobra Commander out of his fucking house. The, oh, we got we found health, everybody. Okay, yeah. Oh, hang on. I think I may have heard a squirrel. That might might be the, the the rustling of the trees. I'm not sure what it is. Hang on, hang on now. Uh maybe. Oh. Oh, <gasps> there he is. There he is. Bullsh- Bullshit! Fuck off, what? It took pity on me, it's like, oh, you're such a bad shot. Let me give you another try, buddy. There's another squirrel for today. Okay, now he's gotta head south. God damn it! Three bullets, more enough to uh, kill those weird things like, you know. Oh, I just found more ammo. Oh wait, there's more squirrels I can get. Can I can I overcompensate perhaps? No, I don't think so. I think there was something at the store that said like you can't get more, idiot. That's that's an evil giant tanuki, okay? That's a that's a goofy ass tanuki. Okay, <laughs> that <laughs> that that ain't hard. That's a goof. All right. What the hell? <laughs> Tom Nook. <laughs> All right. Well, another day, another dollar. All right. Here we go. Head over here and staple some more squirrels to the wall. 
Oh boy, yeah. And oh, oh, oh. But that ain't good. Ugh. Well, uh, time to sleep. I guess we do go check the kitchen, huh? Nothing in here. Hey, who's going around the kitchen, huh? Ah. Huh. Ah, this is, this is my wife. Oh, there we go. Oh, well, you just you just enjoy your snack. All right, things worked out just fine. Time to sleep. You are sleeping. Squirrel mech suit. <laughs> oh, it's back. What day am I on, guys? Is this day four? Is it the last day? Fourth. Oh, geez. Day four. Hey, we got a freebie. All right. I also have to catch. I have to catch four more normal squirrels, and then we have to get the the big one. We'll have to check out that giant squirrel too. Hang on. Hmm. I heard one. I heard one. Let me just, let me just catch a squirrel real quick, and then we can get looking for uh, more. Hang on. Maybe this one around here somewhere. Wait, stay perfectly still, and if something moves, that's a squirrel. Nope. Fine. I'll I'll go check out the paper. See what it's all about. Okay, uh, tip of the day. No, 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 no. You're talking about this. Nope. Okay. Fun fact, the squirrel's natural enemies are weasels, coyotes, badges, f badges, badgers, badges, foxes, and bobcats. Okay. And the squirrels in chat? Badges. <laughs> Okay. How about bullets? Is that one of the weaknesses? Okay, watch out now. Badger in chat. Okay. Uh, up, 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 up. That's right. Ba boom. It's like that. Let's see if we can get some more. Hmm, well, so far so good. How about that been too tricky to find more squirrels, which is good. Because usually when you're playing this. Oh shit. Dude, that is the goofiest thing. What is that? Squirrel bear. Okay, that is the goofiest thing on planet Earth today. You can't put that in your game. It like deflects all the horror. El squirrel gigante. El gordo el squirrel. Okay, dude, I gotta watch that so he's not right behind me as I do this. Got another one. How am I doing? Three more bullets. Might have to get some more. Okay, I hit... No, that's a rock. <gasps> oh! Ah, I got you anyway! Oh, that was a giant one! Yeah, we're kicking ass, everybody. Two more. Oh, oh! Holy shit! Fuck! What the? F uh. Dinner's ready. What the fuck? Okay, this just became terrifying. What? What? What the hell?
I can't concentrate now. I can't concentrate one bit. Okay, there's another one over here. Hang on, I'll try to get him too. Okay, shit, shit. That thing caught me so fucking off guard. There was no sound coming up to you, you know? Oh fuck, okay, hang on. Okay, hang on, hang on. I have four more bullets. <laughs> okay. okay. Here's the squirrel. Where's that squirrel? And where is it now? Okay. Missed, I missed, I missed, I missed, I missed. Hang on. Oh fuck it. God damn it. Get three more bullets. Okay, okay. Now it's time to head home. And... Dude, whatever that thing's chasing me, my wife or whatever, then, uh... There's not enough... Oh, dude, I'm... I'm noited. Dude, that squirrel bear is nothing. Nothing at all compared to that... That, that wife... <laughs> God damn it. Okay, uh... <laughs> Sorry, I'm looking at every direction. I'm not sure if it's doing one of those, like, SCP Weeping Angel things, where, like, if you look at it, it stops. Or whatever, you know. Squirrel fast. Squirrel's delight in causing pain. What the fuck? Okay, uh... <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Me too. Alright, well, here we go. Time to, to deliver squirrels. Okay, got enough ammo. Okay, where am I? Okay, I gotta go I gotta start heading south. This way. That's kind of where my, my wife was at, so... Okay, I'm getting disoriented because, like, I'm looking at every direction here. Like, left, right, up, down, you know. Okay, okay, well, you know what, you know, we can tangle, we can tangle every day. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, she stood still when she caught up to me, right? Okay, do we want to get this? Squirrels are capable of hating me. <laughs> don't, don't say some fucked up shit like that. Hating me. <laughs> um... I don't know hate was a thing in animals. I think they just ran on instinct and experience. But, I mean, yeah. Animals can get angry and stuff like that, but not like to that capacity of hating me. Uh, squirrels can debone a human male in under three hours. Oh, that's that's neat! Ah! Ah! No. No. Right. Okay. Let's head east. He friendly. Brian, look out! Seriously, this game did not need the squirrel bears. I would say get rid of squirrel bears and you have something very terrifying. I mean, it's, it's, it's spooky. I'll say that, but I think they, they definitely detract from the scary. Because it's, it's like ultra goofy, you know. My dog don't bite. Okay, we go. Uh, squirrels are always watching. Oh. All right. All right. Well, we managed to get home safely, and uh, you know, without no problem. Uh, okay. Let's head head back home. Time to staple those squirrels. Hmm. Time to sleep. You are sleeping. Oh boy, today's the day. God is coming. <laughs> Anything in here? Nope. Oh, okay. God time. God is coming today. <laughs> Excuse you. Ah, oh, day five. 
Okay, so they, this is the final day. Okay, uh, still terrifying, because last time we were out here, um, my wife came alive and uh, wanted to uh, decapitate me with her corpse, I think. But I'm sure nothing bad will happen today, you know, we just gotta be vigilant, we have to look around and all that stuff. Wait, what's this? There are more squirrels than you have bullets, and you have made him very, very angry. Sorry? Excuse me. Oops. <laughs> okay. Well, you know what? I am, I am the fastest gunman in the West, so you can't get me. Okay, yeah. I am a little paranoid since last time, as I said, but I will make the most of it. Okay, okay. I hope this game doesn't end in a boss fight where you have to, like, shoot, shoot a boss with an HP bar. Joel, who's my favorite Power Ranger? What, what's that guy? What's that guy? Uh, the Baldi. He's like a giant, giant man. Zordon, yeah, that guy. Yes. This one. I guess he's not a Power Ranger, he's more like a prop. <laughs> but, you know. Morbius time, Joey. Mor Morbius time? What, he's, what are you saying to me? <laughs> Morbius time. Okay, there's some squirrels around here. It's Morbius time. Oh, fuck off. Oh. <sighs> Morbius time. It's Morbius time! Okay, I see you too. Hang on. Let me see if I can. Yes. Double kill. Excellent. Slayer. Okay, dude. I am watching. And I'm watching. No, no. Okay, I'm watching. I just need a giant squirrel. El Gigante Squirrel. What's up with you, huh? Don't, don't do that. Okay. Alright. Does anybody know what that giant squirrel's uh, Twitch name is? I'm trying to ban him. <laughs> okay, yeah. Okay, okay, this is when my wife, quote-unquote, attacked me last time, so... There was about that, that that weird story about, like, my wife, or not my wife, the, the woman pa painted waist up or something like that. Okay, well, um... <laughs> squirrel, squirrel 69. Okay, um... Go in the building, go in the building. Okay. Is that the place? Oh, Jesus. The Lady Part 5. The artist's ears rang as it turned to the old woman and said, What is this unspeakable horror that you have brought to me? How can I ever escape what has been done here? But Penny... Penny spell can you cast to con conjure good from this? And the old woman examined the bloody mess and said, Well, well, young man, this will make a mighty fine stew. And so they made a stew from the remains, but it was poison and they both died. Art will eventually destroy the artist. The end. And they both died. The end. That was the best creepypasta I've ever read. That spooky spaghetti got my asshole real puckered up. Okay.
Okay. I can't tell if that was a giant one or what. No, no, it wasn't a giant one. Does it have to be a giant one? Yes, it does have to be a giant one, unfortunately. Oh, no, 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 no. Run. Fucking run. Fucking run! Fucking run! Okay. <laughs> Bidoof. <laughs> Bidoof. <laughs> okay. See, I told you this last score will be impossible to find. On the final day, too. Unless I can, like, go all the way up here and get, like, a good view of everything. Okay. The final squirrel. Okay, I'm not sure. Pro strategy. Yeah, well, I... I don't know. Don't break the game now. I'll try. I mean, I should really be able to see him, though. It's a, it's a giant squirrel. Okay. Joey, this is your cousin. Let's go bowling together. I have a funny story to tell you about that. My, my, my cousin was stung on the penis by a bee. And he, my, my, my cousin lives, or at that time, lived in, like, a tree house. Uh, and it was like, they built a bee nest, or like a hornet's nest, hornet's nest, sorry, hornet's nest, in that, like, so he woke up one day and there was hornets everywhere, right? And he got stung on the penis. And like his, his p penis ballooned up. And he kept screaming like, oh no, oh no, I've been stung, I've been stung. And he ran into my uncle's house and it's like, look, look, look. And it's like, I don't want to see that. <laughs> my pee pee. Owie. Okay, watch out for that thing. Don't want to mess with that. What did it have to do with bowling? I guess nothing. <laughs> nothing at all. There it is. There it fucking is. X. Jesus. This is... Okay, you know what? You know what? You know what? As long as I can get more health than that thing has... God is coming. I must prepare to meet- What?! Oh, Jesus Christ! Run the fuck home?! What do you mean, God is coming?! Jesus- Okay. Okay. Run, 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 run. Oh, oh, oh! Bullets and health! Bullets and health! God is coming. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Hurry, going to miss God. You know what? You should kind of, like, give me nightmares. I thought it was very creepy. The episode of Tom and Jerry where, like, Tom dies, and he has to, like, catch the, the elevator to heaven. Or he goes into hell. Remember that? Oh, shit, 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 shit. Okay, yeah. Okay, 59 seconds. Can I do it? Okay. I'm trying to press W and D at the same time. God is coming. What the fuck? Am I going the right way? Yes, I am. Okay, okay. 59 seconds, 60 seconds, okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm almost home, I can do this, I can do this. Fuck. God's coming? He sure is! So... Okay, well, let's head inside. I must meet God. No, go inside, you jackass! What the fuck? What do you mean? What? Me? What are you talking about? God is here. Whoa, 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 whoa. What do you mean? What do you mean? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where is it? Ah! Shit, motor!
What the fuck? What the fuck? What was that? <laughs> what the fuck? It was just a it was just a giant squirrel head. That was God. You won the game because you shot and killed God. It feels like American persona, you know? Wow, that <laughs> <laughs> yeah, shit, the boner. <laughs> wow, that, that was great. I, I enjoyed that. I actually enjoyed that. Wow, that was a... I really like this guy's games. Like, uh, Iron Lung and this. It's pretty fucking legit. I, I, I like them, you know. Yeah. 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 Why, why the hell not? Why the hell not, everybody? I, I say that was a that was a very solid game, Squirrel Stapler. Uh, hey, if you're a fan of of, of meeting God, uh, check that game out. I suppose. All right. Well, that was one of the games. There's, uh, you know, a couple to go. Um, so, what, what should we play next, everybody? Any recommendations? Solipsis. Sucker for love. Solipsis. When will you play Sucker for Love full game? Full game. That's a visual novel. Oh, is, is that the Cthulhu dating simulator game s s game I saw on Steam? Is that that one? Yeah, I heard about that one. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 that I can take that for 10 minutes max and then it devolves into me talking like a baby for like an hour and you know, I'm gonna, my brain is gonna turn into like mashed potatoes. All right, I, I can't do it. All right. I'll do it at some other point, but I'll, I'll, let me play something that's like scary. Okay, I'm in the mood for that. Not, not that. Okay. Uh. <laughs> gooba, gooba, gooba. <laughs> okay, it's voice acted. Oh, really? I mean, like that helps. Okay. Yeah. Well, there's the game. Let's see what it is. <laughs> Win the heart of an eldritch horror and smooch her at any cost. I said it had skipped this tape. Oh, fuck it. Alright, well, uh... So I need another key here, right? Do I have a key? Ah, oh, look at this. Uboa! 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 Okay. Summon Uboa! Solipsis sounds like something I played on the Haunted Place in One Collection. It's like these games aren't tied to that though. But uh speaking of where is the the keys? What is this? Charlotte's Exile. Charlotte has gone missing. The last hope of an embracing lies with an old note written in an ancient language. Okay, yeah. Ellipsis, two astronauts search for geological features beneath the surface of the moon. They find one. <laughs> uh, that... <laughs> hey guys, Iron Lung 2, everybody. Uh, right. I need to find a key first, though. Uh, and I seem to not be able to find that. Um... No, 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 I was just done, I was done, I was done with Squirrel Stapler. Okay. Nope. Alrighty, uh, welcome back. Hope you picked the right tape, or this whole thing is fucked. Did he just swear? Did the video game just swear, guys? No, I'm just kidding. Guys, please, 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 uh, remove this, uh, stream from your history tabs. Your mom might or may not be checking your history. Alright. I think it's all the door shut. Or uh, maybe I did set the order and now I'm just tricking the virus into specific 
virus. This is touched by an outer god. The growth that invaded our world. Kill them, eat their flesh, become strong. <laughs> Oh. Oh, neat. Hey, 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 look at this. This, this looks like something you'd see in Daggerfall, <laughs> you know? Speaking of, Daggerfall is on Steam now, uh, you know. Oh, an arm. Found a body part. Ah, interesting. Oh, look at this. So there's this, this interactivity. And a leg. Okay, yeah. Another one, too. Hey, a bibble. Okay, anything else? Was this area made by the dust developer, like the hub world? Okay. Oh, not my life use. It's so funny. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> That's the weirdest, weirdest uh, game of pipe mace ever played, or whatever it's called. The blood, the blood, the blood. Ah, oh, look at that! I found a key here. Excellent. Hey, what's over here? Oh, a head. Anything else? No, it's a sink. Or oh, the doghouse. It's not a doghouse. It's a shed. For Bitter Blade Volume 3, the final volume tells of Umberth's madness and corruption as great evil did possess him and make him horrid. Umberth stalked the kingdom and struck down all those opposed him until the fields lay barren and the streets were painted with blood. Neat. A painting scrapper. Okay, well, I guess we're heading inside then. This case reminds me a little bit of... What was that game we played? Oh, hang on. Tool the Tim Man tail. <laughs> Ah. Ah, uh, I, uh, I, I, uh, I see. Joey smart, okay? Joey smart, okay? Don't think that Joey doesn't get these things, all right? Joey is smart. Too. You know, I was going to say we play a Steam game that was like a horror game in a, in a mansion, and the, the rest of the game was like fear or like a SWAT tactical game. But this is one section of the game. That was like generally fucking frightening as fuck. What is what was that called? What was that game called? Underhell. Yes, Underhell. I thought the game was scary as hell. You know? Underheck. Two bits. Hey, I know that JPEG splatter. I use that on my thumbnails all the time now. Yes, I play the organ. See, sometimes my jokes are so fucking funny and I don't get enough credit for them, alright? Okay, what's this? Found a painting scrap. Oh, let, let me let me devolve my comedy so it's a little more more up Twitch's, you know, <clears throat> comedy. Hello, I play the I play to the nutsack. <laughs> play the balls. <laughs> Now that's comedy. Okay, here we go. Man, fly, dog, cow, rabbit, and water. Sure, there's a lot here. So this is this is like an extra game, in fact. Okay, let's see what this is. The king of titties. <laughs> Tithes demand payment to be precise, the pound of flesh this time in blood. 
Okay. Oh, hey, look at that. That sound effect is like from Diablo 2 when you touch the, the eye of Caleb or whatever it's, it is. <laughs> uh, watch me accidentally like brute force this and win. No, I don't think so. Pronounce teeths. Teeths. Okay, I'm playing Diablo 2 right now, can't confirm. There's some sound effects from Diablo 2 that I will never leave my head. And it's the sound of the gold falling to the floor. Or like a sword, like a claymore, it's like a chunky thud. You know? Tithe, ti, Okay. A pound... Are you serious? Are you su Oops. Oops. I wasn't meant to do that. But, uh... Yeah... What does it say? Two bits. Two trucks. But I don't get the... I don't get the... Two bits. There is a... a some wood? Um... Hmm. It's shave and a haircut. This I don't know what this what what what's this shave and a haircut? What are you talking about? Shave and a haircut? Is that some Drake song that I don't know? He doesn't know. Google it. I, I wait, hang on. Shave and a haircut. Two bit. I don't know what this is. Song, hang on. Shave and a haircut, fruit of the month club. What, happened to what is this? What is this? What is this? Wrong. What is this? Shave and a haircut. There we go. What is this? Wrong again. What is this? Okay, somebody has a link. Somebody has a link. Here we go. Okay, here we go. That's what you're talking about? Sucking penis? Here it is. That is what shaving a haircut is? I, I know what that is. I didn't know it had a name. I thought it was just like... I thought that was the... Like, uh... Incidental somebody... Like, cracks their head open and, and all the life juice comes out. And it's just like, haha! You know, and you play this. Alright. bam ba da bam 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 Yeah, but this is gonna be possible. Like, what? what? Shave and a haircut, two bits. But how will I play this? What, what notes are these? I don't really play the foot. Dun 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 dun. Hang on. It's like, hang on. Oh Jesus, I, I don't have a string on this thing. Oh, it's like... Right? Yeah. Oh, fuck. Interesting. 
So what what nose do these correspond to? You know. See, so that's like a what is that? It's like a a C. But they sound like they're minor keys. So. Hang on, wait a minute. If this was like, hmm, is there mo more? No, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, maybe, maybe, maybe this could go somewhere. Like that? Would that work? Yeah. No, not no. You can tune the meat hooks. Really? How does one tune the meat hooks? Hang on. Uh. No, you can't. Okay. Hmm. You're overthinking it. Mm, hang on, no. No, the last one we it was higher, you know. So, this is the lowest note. This is the lowest note. So, we won't have to do it that way. Dun, 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 dun. Musical master. Okay, so it's in minor key instead. Well, I guess it fits the game, you know. We removed his tongue to save him from judgment. We removed his eyes to save him from witnessing what we were becoming. Okay. What else do we have up here? Oh my god. So, guys, when I was baby. When I was baby, my neighbor was having a yard soil. And one day I went over and he had a uh, Super Duper Mario on the Sega Genesis. I went over there, I got a cartridge, I put it back into my Nintendo shit cube, and let me tell you something, Sonic came out of screen, sucked my dick until my penis bled hyper-realistic red use. Okay, uh, the Bitter Blade volume. Here is in the detail of Umbers, who is as a young man wandered the kingdoms as a vagrant, aimless, and beset with lethar le lethargy, until lo and angel did appear to him and speak a prophecy that Umbers would one day rule the land unchallenged. Okay, well here we go. Watch me do this. Ready? Two hours later. Sorry, I, I'll, I'll take it a little seriously. All right, so um, I'm not sure what this is a reference to. Elk 
alchemical notes on the const constitution of blood. The flesh of man is most prized with hunters next and the prey, but all blood is still thicker than water, which only makes one less pure. So this is a hint towards the thing at the bottom with the, the uh, you know, Breaking Bad meth uh, lab. Listen, the flesh of man is most prized with the hunters next and then the prey. Hunters next. Okay, but all blood is still thick in water, which only makes them one less pure. Jesse, what the fuck are you talking about? It's kind of weird. I stopped watching Breaking Bad when Jesse got a love interest, and apparently I, I, I got, like, sort of baited because she doesn't stick around for long, but I was just like, oh, great, now we gotta have a fucking love. I guess in a weird way, I wanted Walter White and, like, Jesse to just be, like, having a bromance all the time, and I'm like, no, don't introduce some fucking, some lady that I don't care about, you know? Okay, Joel, no, I, I'll I'll watch it. You know, why would that make you stop watching? Because I felt like, you know, you know what it felt like. You know what that feeling felt like. I guess it was it was getting a little too real for me. I really like Jesse, and I like Walter. And you know when you have like a good buddy that you've spent years with, and you you have so many good memories and all that shit. Suddenly he gets a girlfriend out of nowhere, and like you can't tell him that this lady is so dumb and so mean and all these things and you want to be like yeah i'm happy for you and you just notice slowly that he hangs out less with you and he keeps like and you don't relate to her at all and you just want to be like please break up basically yoko oh no problem yeah sure you want to speak some Umber's ascension of the rank of knight, on through the prowess of jousting and warfare. It closes with Umber's confrontation with a terrible demon, which is slays but the grace of God. So a terrible demon. So. Hmm. What's the third book? I should keep watching it. Umber, who has a young man, won the king of Zavagrad. Yes. So. Here we go. So with Lith uh, Lo, an angel did appear, right? An angel, right? There we go. Okay, and now that's the third volume, which means that... Right, so that happened somewhere. Um, there we go. No, not quiet. I think I just got the solution anyway. Nope. There we go. And then uh, this would go into... Uh, Yes, gotcha. I had I had I had an idea that all these like old uh, old tales revolved around some sort of like horrible fate at the end. Okay, dude, we've had we have plenty of oh, what's this? Face the truth, even if it blinds you. Found a painting scrap. Let's do another game before we end because we're playing a lot in the hub world, but uh, you know. Vinny has been watching Breaking Bad lately. You should ask him if he should pick it back up. Uh, uh, well, yeah, we talked about Breaking Bad. I said the same thing to you guys as I talked said to Vinny when, when we were out at a bar. And I'm like, dude, I, nah, I don't know. He's like, you should keep watching it. I'm like, nah, nah, nah. Okay. My friend. Cashel referred to Breaking Bad as Breaking Brad, and I, like, he didn't see the show. Um, and then, like, I wanted to, like, say how stupid he was, so I kept referring it, when he referred to it as, like, Breaking Brad, I'm like, yeah. Yeah, I watched a little bit of Breaking Benjamin last night, and I just, like, I kept upping the ante of how stupid it could get. And then he didn't, like, pick up what I was doing, and I'm like, okay, fuck this. Sucker for love. <sighs> Okay, guys, we're not gonna play Sucker for Love, we're gonna play one more thing. Was Breaking Benjamin the band that did, like, the, the soundtrack for Halo 2? Blow me away, only the strongest will survive. Well, it seemed like a hillbilly, but, you know. They, they, yes. Play the Torpal Duke game? Okay. The Thing in the Lake by... Pantstales. Something horrible is hiding in the murky depths. The thing in the... Oh, that looks fun. 
Anyways, another late night by Secret Cow Level. You're up late playing video games and messing around on the internet and things take a dark turn. You shit yourself and you try to cover up the, the farting sounds with funny clown music, but it inadvertently creates more funny. Ar arcade let Arcade let Arcade Litra, okay. Electronics and an arcade and video rental store begin to come to life. Starting ways when an unknown world is discovered. Okay. I was going to dismiss that as a little FNAF, but uh, no. The toy shop. What do you do when you can't trust what you see, hear, or th touch? Do you take your fate in your own hands or play on as someone else's toy? Okay. To the end of days by Scythe Dev Team. The world is ending as I... Comet looms. Can you make it home to your family? Okay. Charles Exile. And we have uh, this game. Undiscovered. A cursed tomb of kings lies hidden deep in the ancient jungle. Explore the tomb, learn its secret, and find what lies undiscovered. And the game that we were going to play was... What is this? The Diving Bell. Isolation takes its toll on even the strongest of wills. Survive the crushing depths of the ocean and reach your salvation. That seems a lot like Iron Lung, like, you know. Okay, well, it's between Solipsis for me, and I want to give a... Wait, the thing in the lake. This, Solipsis, and this seems cool. This seems cool, too. And then, uh... I mean, they're all kind of neat. I kind of want to give them all... Oh, I'm being watched. I just noticed. Those ellipses, uh, it's short too. Uh, it's pretty quick. Let's do it real quick. Yeah, Forky's gonna do both. You know what? You know what? Yeah, you know what? Let's do both. Let's do both. Fuck it. And Undiscovered. Undiscovered was uh, Torpal's Duke's game, right? Yes, it's right there, the T, I think. Yes. No, play the eight hour long one. Okay, well, here we go. Undiscovered. No, no. Yes. Oh, here's how you do it. Ah, here we go. Yes. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. So apparently Torpal Duke made this in 10 days. It's going to be interesting to see where it comes out of this. I'm sorry, but like, I don't want to meme, but music to make you poop. Alright, here we go. You can play as uh, man or woman. They both have two arms. The United States of America Department of Mysteries. Status classified top secret. The following footage was recovered from a handheld film that came around Earth on August 27th of 1956 in a small village in Northern Titan. The camera was estimated to have been buried for the last decade, though the film itself was still intact. Expeditions to find the locations depicted on the film reels have so far been fruitless. This is like 1930s voice. <laughs> the following footage is the recovered contents of that camera. All right, is it on? Are you recording? Press E to advance dialogue. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yep, we're good. Okay, then. Um, hello there. My name is Dr. Marty Williams, and I am an archaeologist as well as a professor of ancient cultures. I'm here today at the newly uncovered archaeology archaeological site somewhere in the jungles of South America. To my knowledge, I'm the first person to set foot on this location since the indigenous people built it roughly a thousand years ago. Since then, the site is completely untouched. I brought along a video camera to document the entire exploration. To this end, I brought along my ice, ever trusty and faithful assistant. Not to mention wife... <clears throat> Janet, to film my every step as my personal camera crew. I'm just as excited to be here as you are, Marty. And may I see you look great on camera. Yes, yes. With, with that introduction, we might as well drop our pants and start fucking in the South America. <laughs> P 
porno. Incredible, these ruins are possibly ancient. Okay. See, this is placed in 1956. Why am I wearing, like... I don't know, I feel like... Very contemporary clothes. I should be having, like, a top hat. <laughs> no, wait, no, 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 no. I'm still thinking of 30s. Wow, what a view. It's 46. I should have known a little bit about Aztec culture, you know. It's it's a fascinating thing. I used to sacrifice people to the sun god by, like, putting them on an altar. And, like, stabbing them in the heart and taking out. Like, it's, it's crazy stuff. Well, there's a note over here. But aren't we the first people here since the place was built? As far as I'm aware, yes. Who could have left it here then? In our conquest in the name of the Empire of Spain, my unit has occupied a nearby village in search of gold and glory. The village is sort of a nearby ancient tomb that sounds ripe for plundering. They also mentioned that the tomb is cursed and is forbidden for anyone to enter. Ridiculous. The superstition of the locals never failed to amuse. We should enter this tomb as soon as we can. All right. Simply incredible. This site was originally discovered by Spanish conquistadors. Why haven't we heard of this before? Surely this would have been written about in the history books. No idea. We must investigate further. Maybe we'll find the answers we seek. Okay. Hey, Williams. Why don't you shuffle a little bit in the, in the video? Oh, okay. My god! We've unearthed footage of the first twerking. It was not Cardi B who invented the twerk. It was William in the... South America. Am I- am I going... Like... Up and more and more? Okay. <laughs> you just dropped something, Joel. That I, I, I did? Where? Yeah. What are you talking about? In real life. My- my guitar pick! Ow! <sighs> That's the price of gaming. Haha, huh? <laughs> he fell. Alright. Well, let's head on down. Excellent bit. You know, if you're gonna travel all the way to like South America in the 50s and 40s and whatever, don't you have like, a, 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 like, you know, like, I think of this shit and I think of this. Hang on. Uh, like, I, I think of this kind of shit. Maybe it's a little too early, but I, 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 I <laughs> yeah, it's a little too early for this, but you know, this kind of stuff. Here we are in the South America, see indigenous people, and look at that, there's a papaya fruit, like that, that kind of shit. Like this, not just like this guy, he's just like, he, he, he looks like a YouTuber, you know, he looks like he's about to shill Manscaped for me. Or whatever the fucking call it, the, 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 the shaving stuff. <laughs> you know? Oh, yo, what's up, everybody? We're checking out this fucking tomb, alright? Now, I want to give you a big shout out to my main man, Big Suck69. Okay, YouTuber using black and white filter, alright. It's Chris Pratt. Well, this place is incredible. Indeed, this is the most intact site I've ever seen. Let's see what mysterious it, mysteries it holds. No, William! No, don't suck off the skeleton! No, I know it's funny, but stop it! Ah! Okay, shouldn't he ask who lets, who tends these fires? Who keeps these torches lit? 
<laughs> Who's, the statues are realistic. Excellent craftsmanship. Statues. The statues? These statues aren't realistic? Hmm. My god, William, there's an apparition on the camera! On the first episode of Ghost Hunters, William goes into a South American tomb. Okay. <laughs> These statues. Dev crying right now. I'm, I'm, do, 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 Torpal, Torpal, if you're watching still, I, I say these things with, a, with with love, okay? When I make fun of something and I make funny comments, that isn't to say game bad. That is to say Joey having fun, okay? Don't worry about it. We've entered the tomb and have thus far seen no sign of any curse. We are protected by God himself. <clears throat> Uh, no curses, imaginary or otherwise, could ever do us harm. Regrettably, we have yet to find any of the gold we were promised by the captain, but he assures us that it must be and been further, for, hidden further into the tomb. Okay. I would wield that sword. I mean, I guess they don't have any reason to yet, but... Also, I don't think film, commercial film back then, had the, the film real capacity to shoot for this long. I'm not sure, but, um... Uh... Okay. God is coming. Lost immersion. See, the, the, it's just me taking too long to play the game, so... Okay. What is suspension of disbelief? I don't know, but I'll tell you what. I did tell you guys the story about my mother watching Doctor Strange. Um... I keep cracking up about my own story, but if you weren't there for it, if you missed this, uh, during Easter, me and my family sat down and we were going to watch some movies, and trying to find a movie for all of us to enjoy at the same time is quite the task, because at that point, you also have to, like, account for uh, no sex scenes, please, entertaining, funny, and, like, keep the language PG-13, and also be entertaining and all that stuff. So we picked Doctor Strange, and for some fucking reason, my mom would not fucking watch this movie. She kept, like, crossing her arms and going, no, you can't do that, because... Here's what I thought. My mom read the synopsis to the movie saying like, a surgeon loses his hands in a car accident and goes and he goes to alternative medicine to find a solution to get his hands back. And she thought it was like a melodramatic movie. And what she got instead was like Alvin and the Chipmunks and she was so offended by it. That's a one big skeleton. Were ancient people really that big? <laughs> No, get get your boss out. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. We have still not found an ounce of gold in this ghastly place. As we began to raise our concerns to the captain, we heard sounds coming from behind a wall. We inspected a couple of conspicuous torches, and uh, behold, there was a hidden passage behind it. One of the villagers must have heard of our coming and moved all the gold even deeper underground. We'll find the savage and show him how to deal with these who stand in the way of the Empire. Okay. What? Uh, it looks like two members goes deeper than the thought. I don't see any secret passage here, though. But it wouldn't be very secret if it were obvious, would it? Let's just keep looking around. Maybe we can't find these torches. Okay, nice. I can't say- I don't know how to pronounce that. What do you think? Would a sword make a good souvenir? I don't know. Would that count as grave robbing? Only a little bit. Yes, leave it. Besides, we're only living- we're only- we're the only living things in here. It's not like we're going to be attacked by monsters or something. Uh -huh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, man. Hmm, the torches look pretty mm -hmm, to me. I agree. What do you say we light them and see what happens? Sure, as soon as we find something to light them with. <laughs> oh, that was my windows. It scared me. Okay. I guess we're heading here. What about to take the torch? Take the torch and light the other one. What? Ask your mom to watch Morbius. It's a good movie. Okay. I keep seeing Morbius being memed. What's 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 the deal, chat? What's the deal with this Morbius?
It's the worst Mar Marvel movie? I, I don't think it is a Marvel movie. It's awful. It's bad. <laughs> really? It was meh, so people just hype it up to cope. <laughs> These tools must have been left behind by the previous occupants. Let's take them. They might turn out to be useful. Okay. Sure. It's already a torch equipped with the light objects in front of you. Okay. Precisely. Okay. All right. Awesome. It made more billion tickets. It starts Jared Leto, and everyone hates Jared Leto because he's a creep. Okay. Not because he's the Joker? I don't know. I'll, I'll just say this. I'll just say this. Uh, I, uh... I... I... I kind of like, for years, I don't know why I'm talking about this now, but for years I watched, I didn't watch these Marvel movies, right? And I, I've been going on this like spree to watch all of them chronologically, right? And I gotta say, they're just kids' movies. Like, they're, they're just, they're okay. I just don't like understand what the goddamn hype is about it. Like, they're just like, ah, you know, it's an okay movie, but it's a kind of movie you're like, if you were like, if you had a little brother and he had a DVD, he's like, let's watch Iron Man. He's like, oh, you know. See, I need to watch real shit. I need to see stuff, stuff like, I, I need comedies like uh, Begotten. At least one person understood that joke. They turn off your brain movies. Yeah, we, yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I mean, they're okay. Amazing, a secret passage into a cave system. It looks man made. I wonder what they would use this tunnel for. It sure is dark. Yeah. Yes, but don't be afraid. The more discoveries await. We may run into a rat or two. Oh, shit, a rat! But I trust we can hold our own against the likes of them. If you say so. See, you know what I find, find superior to the Marvel movies? The DC animated series, like Batman Beyond and Justice League. I thought that had more of like, maybe I was younger when I watched it, I don't know. But I felt like that had more of a emotional impact on me, because I'm... I felt like I was watching more like... Comic book stuff? I don't know how. This reminds me of a dream I had once. I walked down an endless tunnel alone for what felt like hours. It was horrible. Did we get to the end? Oh no, I eventually was killed by an unseen presence in the darkness. Then I woke up. Lovely. Mm -hmm. Like sawing Scoob! Ah, uh, dead end. That doesn't make any sense. But check out the wall. It doesn't look too sturdy. Ah, uh, this will be a job for my trusty pickaxe. Stand back, honey. Let's see what this thing can do. Artie's torch equipped to swing the pickaxe. Okay, guys, Minecraft. Just gonna light my wife on fire. What's it? It's Q, right? And then... I thought I just saw a skeleton hand there, but uh, I don't think that's it. Okay, uh, we discovered that the tomb connects to a natural cave. It goes on much wider and deeper than we imagined. So Sanchez was ordered to map out our surroundings as we go. We have still not caught sight of the thief we are after. We have heard more sounds in the cave. Sometimes they're like growls or groans, or they're like the voice of a man. Indistingu indistinguishable in the echo of the cave, sometimes they, all, they come as a whisper. Not to the ear, but seemingly in the mind. I've begun to dislike this place and may soon tell the captain that we should head back. Okay. Oh, fuck it. Nito. Nito. Oh, these are statues, thank goodness. 
Do you think there were real skeletons? No, no, no. It's just not something you want to see in the dark. This must have been the storage closet for statues. I wonder why they made so many skeletons, though. I wonder if we can turn around and leave. On my way to beat Pinhead. Who are you calling Pinhead? I mean, Pinwheel, fuck. <laughs> Pinhead. Is that skeleton gonna lunge at me? Or what? what the devil is that? It looks like another one of those statues. Is it wearing armor? I think we should go near it. That's... That's the sound of Resident Evil 4 dudes. No, no, this this got incredibly goofy. It's another one of those conquistadors. Sanchez went crazy and attacked his own comrades, ranting something about the new god. Forced to put him down, unfortunately his map was destroyed to the mayhem. We have begun to search for the way back to the surface, but some of us fear we may not take it. Well, this must be Sanchez. That answers that question. How bizarre, the new god? Squirrel god. The dork must have gotten to him. Um, god is coming. Can you just light this? Do the skeletons like, uh, fire? Is just me, or does it sound like a laundry machine winding down after like a thousand, like, you know... Okay, yeah. Oh my god. See, I like this game. I like this game because it has it has merit, okay? It has skeletons in it. See, a lot, a lot of spooky games these days just go for skeletons, but this game does. So it is the scariest game of, of these two, you know? What kind of place is this? It's ridiculous. Perhaps they're traps to deter thieves? Hey, the bottom of that pillar doesn't look too stable. I bet you can destroy it with your pickaxe. Ah yes, I believe you're right. Let's find out, shall we? <laughs> okay. Go back and light all the torches for a secret. It's worth it. Okay. Glad the developer's here to tell us this. Okay. What about Sanchez? He's gonna, like, fight me? <laughs> yeah, we're just vandalizing this, this ancient, you know, place. Okay. Come on, Sanchez. There's no need for that. Sanchez, no! Sanchez! Don't do that! Oh. Okay, I guess we're trying that again. Wait, did you see Chris break it? No. The problem is, the problem is, <laughs> when you play certain video games, you get very, like, familiar with sounds, and having a Resident Evil 4 dude speak, like, creepy Spanish for me, is the equivalent of hearing, you know, like, Mario shit, you know, like, what? So it's, it's, it's like, difficult for me, you know. Okay, this way goes there. Okay, yeah. So, Torpal himself says, Don't worry, it gets goofier. Torpal, you, the creator, is saying this gets goofier? Is awesome. I can't wait. <laughs> okay. Did I miss the torch? I like how Sanchez isn't like chasing me. He's just kind of like, hey, you leave. Fuck off. Hey, fuck you. Get out of me cave. Huh? Talking shit. I... Where are you guys seeing this torch? I... Wait, where's the torch? You missed it again. Oh, I see it.
Oh shit, here comes Sanchez. Okay, now what? Hmm. Fall us ominously. Should I go left? Okay. This is open now, perhaps? No. Okay, we went here now. Maybe I should open it up. I'll try. <laughs> big, big swing. Don't you mean sans sh shes? I do not understand what you mean. No. Oh. Illusionary wall ahead. Okay. I wonder how I should do that. What the fun Easter egg? I don't think that was the Easter egg. Okay. Okay, here we go. There's a certain Tomb Raider game, a certain Tomb Raider quality in this game, and I'm not saying it because I'm literally raiding a tomb, but, you know. Oh, I, I laid them all. Okay. Hmm. And I've gone here, too. Okay, so it just resets. Do I gotta bait him out? Like, come here. Uh, come on. Come on. Come on. Dude, if somebody saw this from the like the US government saying like this expedition or whatever, they'd be like, what the fuck? You put a bunch of like skeletons on a string in a cave? Get the fuck out of here, you know. <laughs> they wouldn't believe this footage. Okay. Just be like, oh, really? Okay. Yeah, excuse me, I'm coming through. No. Hmm. I need to light one other torch. Okay. So I missed something. Yeah, we go here. Maybe it's back here. I see it. I see it. There we go. Oh, another one. Another one. I heard a sound coming from the hallway to the left. Oh, boy. Alright. Whatever this is. Uh... uh. Watch out, watch out. It's almost like a Silent Hill-esque vibe to the, the skeletons with the noise. Oh? The way is shut. Last you cast the right spell? Oh? This is a reference to my Dread X Collection 1 game. Oh, well, I'm starting on the second one, so I'm... Shit. Wait, 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 wait. Are you talking about uh, Earl's fishing trip? It's Ort. 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 Ort, Ort, Ort. What? What? What are you talking about? Did I just get like one guy? How about please? <laughs> Baited. Ort, ort, ort. Tal F is ort. What? Oh, fuck. Now we're talking, all right. It was so worth it. Okay, yes. 
Yes. Hey, let's mess, make, make some guest 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 dancers up here. You know, we have we have this, but we can also have the. Uh, who else is gonna come for jo to join? Oh, I, I know. How about uh, the, the 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 chowder man? You know, we have we'll have the chowder man. Then we'll have uh, you know, uh, friend just saying hello, and then we'll have uh, who else wants to join? Uh, who else is on my desktop taking up space? Uh, We have a friend rolling, and then we can have a uh, friend driving, and then we can also have a uh, friend puking. Thank you. Fucking great. I'm feeling sick. Okay, scary activates. You go in the dancing room, please. <laughs> oh my god. What will the government think about that, though? They're gonna say... Johnson, they figured out. Uh, what, what was that mind mind kill shit they used in the seventies? What is it called? Uh, it's like a code word for it. What is it called? Uh, Operation <sighs> MK Ultra. Yes, MK Ultra. Yes, there we go. Johnson, they figured out MK Ultra. They figured out Fox Die. Okay, Mortal Kombat Ultra. No, 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 come on. Yes, let's collapse this cave on ourselves. Truly smart. Okay, okay, there we go. Ooh! There we go, and we got two more. This feels like a Mario Party mini game, you know? What's Chris Angel up to nowadays? Chris Angel, holy shit. Mind freak. Okay, there we go. And off we go into the cave. You know, the moment you see a, a skeleton with a sword coming your way, that's when you get the fuck out. You don't like, go descend deeper. That's like knowing uh, the equivalent of like, you know, this box is full of scorpions. Let's stick your hand in it. You'll die. Oh, that sounds lovely. In a search for a way up, we decided to venture deeper to the cave to see if there may be another pa path to the surface. The walls have changed from cold stone to a stinking, slimy, flesh-like material. What kind of cave is this? Some fear that we have descended into hell itself. Okay. We have become separated in the darkness. At first, I could hear my comrades calling out, but the walls have drowned out any sound, and I'm now totally alone. I think some sometimes about Sanchez raving about the new god and wonder if there was some truth in his madness. Poor chap. It sounds like all of the marauding conquistadors lost their minds wandering blindly down here. But what did he mean by flesh-like material? No idea. I find it a little, little weird that, like, we're not freaking out more about... HOLY SHIT SKELETONS! What the? How about no? Okay. I feel that I will meet my doom here down in the dark with my comrades, surely lost beyond all hope. I cannot stop thinking about the new god, or rather, it cannot stop thinking about me. 
I feel a presence peering him in through the cracks of my mind. This is either the work of one true god or the devil himself. We shall see, which greets me as I wander these halls. No, I don't think so. No. Nope. Thank you. M my niece? I have seen it. Glorious is the new god. I wish to never leave its sight. I shall protect it from any of that seeks to disturb its halls and its slumber. Praise be to him. Who is it gonna be, guys? I thought it was the... Uh, what is that VSD plugin? Uh, it's like this, like, monk chanting? What is it called? Uh... Delay Lama, yes. <laughs> oh, how you doing? Well, this must be the new god we've heard so much about. What do we do now? It looks like we're trapped in here. Uh, I can't stand being under its gaze. I've got to do something about it. Like what? All you have is a torch. There's no way out of here. What do we do now? I'm not going to let myself get trapped by that oversized eyeball. What can do with something called a new god? Let's turn up the heat. Hasiya would like an eye full of torch. This is this is this is so goofy, and I kind of love it. You know what this entire thing makes you think of? <laughs> oh, I guess I'm done. See ya. <laughs> and you just leave. <laughs> Goodbye. Okay. Wait, do you hear something? Huh? Oh shit. Oh. Dormammu, I've come to bargain. Marty, no! Get out of here! Boy, cat! No, not without you. It's too late for me! <coughs> no! Marty, no! Okay. Well, that's an FPS game, huh? Oh, I like that. Nope, nope, don't think so. That is DLA Llama, isn't it? Like, actually DLA Llama. Oh, skeleton. <laughs> yes, it is. It's great. Okay. Yeah, the shift from second person to first person is actually cool. I, I like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's cool. The skeleton appears. The skeleton appears? The walls have changed back to normal here. I can't believe Marty will be lost in here. But the loss will not be in vain. Once I escape, I'll publish out the findings and make sure the world knows about what happened here. How we know how I discovered a god. World leaders will lust for its power and only I know where to find it. I'll make a fortune sound to the highest bidder. I just need to escape first. What power does it have? That it can look around a lot? Excuse me, in the way. I guess not. Somebody said, haha, no pants. <laughs> P 
People will pay millions for my gooey eyeball. It's the new god, it can look. And it can see. But what does it do? Nothing. The new god. <laughs> okay. Dr. Eyeball. Okay, yeah. Uh, he can float around. He's cool, though. I'm surprised this game hasn't given me a weapon yet. And I, I just have a feeling, that, you know, at some point we're gonna get to that. But, no, I respect it. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Is that a way out? I'm almost out of this hellish place. It's a little further. Okay. Finally, getting out of the Windows 98 screensaver. <laughs> Mike Wachowski looking ass. What? No, 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 no. It was the mouth. It's so dark in here. The air is so heavy. So warm. So beautiful. Praise the new god. Oh, I became eyeballs. That was fun. That was fun. That was fun. This was done in 10 days, and I'm gonna judge it on... Did I have fun streaming it? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. It was Goof City Population Me, and I liked it a lot. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The music also made me kind of hungry, so, you know, hey, yeah. All right, well, next one is going to be, uh, where was it? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hang on. Torpal Duke says, thank you so much for playing. Every game in this collection was made in 10 days, so I'm blown away by the quality. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, that was a lot of fun. It was a lot of, a lot of fun to do that. Very nice. Very, very nice. Thanks for dropping by, I would say, you know. It's always cool when the developers do, but, uh, it was, it had, I had a very sort of, I don't know what the word is weird quality to it where you don't see like skeletons sincerely done too often and I, it was very unapologetic for that and i i enjoyed the 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 the, the spooky factor in that so yeah very nice but it was fun to see a south american kind of like tomb thing you know but uh great shit anyway slipsis oh yeah i gotta do this again i forget a very short game too so you know guys what if the next game here is about like meeting god again <laughs> won't that be something huh okay this looks neat solipsis options credits all right let's begin You know, it's strange that I became an astronaut. I had a nightmare as a kid, being alone on the moon. When I woke up and I would look out the window and find a moon in the sky. You know, to prove I wasn't still on it. On some nights, I would see a face there. Daniel Mullen Games presents... A game for the Dread X Collection. Mm. Solipsis. All right. Oh. Feeling just fine. Okay. Okay. Guys. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. 
Is the aspect ratio a little fucky for you guys too? I mean, I think it's supposed to be this way. I can see it. Press D to measure gravity. Yeah. Okay. All right. I don't know what that is. Would it work if I did this? Rest in peace, John! Big man. Hopefully, big man's watching the stream right now and haven't eaten a turducken. Okay. Looking at minus fifteen point five milligals. Hmm. Definitely some sort of subsurface feature. I'm gonna guess that the moon is hollow in this game. <laughs> I'm just dancing on the moon. It's made out of cheese, Joel. Huh? Okay, there's, there's something in the way here. Oh, it's a rock. Okay. You're just out there. There we go. Huh? That's low. What's your reading? Looking at negative 120 here. Okay. Something spooky going on. There's something weird going on here. Oh man. What's your reading surface? You know, I was gonna make any uh Wallace and Gromit jokes, but that looks like Gromit, okay? Rationalize it. Press R to rationalize it. Do I have to? <laughs> no. Whoa, look at this. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is cool. <laughs> wow, this looks great. Look at this. That's really nice. Huh. It must be broken. No thoughts had empty. I need to adjust my orbit. Very interesting. Finally, I am the guy with the biggest dick on the moon. Kaching! Oh, wow. That's not good. <laughs> Somebody thought that was an UFO, but that was the moon lander. Fuck it. Okay. <laughs> People have seen UFOs from, like, you know, uh, like, lander stuff in space. Like, weird comments that fly around that shouldn't be there, you know. Mm -hmm. That's just weather balloons. Don't worry about it. That's just mustard gas. Yes. <laughs> That's just a SpaceX car. Yeah. The secret you can look, you can type in, okay. You lie. Okay. You mean swamp gas, not mustard gas. Dude, I, I don't know. Fort gas. 
Okay, it was a different version of the game, I guess. Ah, uh, can I look under the rocks. Then? Okay, yeah. You know, speaking of uh, the moon, whenever I listen to Pink Floyd, it's like. Yeah. Dark Side of the Moon is such a great album. I just wish that woman singing on the great gig in the sky would be quiet for several days. Because it's like, it's such an instrumentally nice composition. And then she comes screaming at you and like, uh, turn it off. Okay. So whenever I want to listen to that song, I look up piano instrumental cover on YouTube. <laughs> Press R, Joey. Okay. Fair observation, but I like it too. They apparently instructed her to scream like she was going to die. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, buddy. That is not the sound of, of uh, someone dying, okay? Like, this woman is just, you know... A sound of a woman dying is this. I'm just saying. Joe, you were exaggerating, was I? A lot of wondering. Hmm. See, it's the it's that. What's that? Is that nothing that's going on that's creepy about it? Too. You know. Just alone on the moon. With nothing going on here. Oh wait, hang on. Is that my foot? That was my foot. Press R. Press R. Hmm. Bone guy. Oh, epic. I guess we'll just keep on going like north. Then. Press G. Oh. Okay. I guess we'll. Okay. That that's the that's the thing. Huh? Okay. I guess I gotta find the right spot. Then. Okay. Okay, that makes a little more sense. Hey, what's this over here? 159. Hey, it's a signal simulator, everybody. <laughs> okay, yeah. Okay, nope. That's a little. Maybe you gotta go a little down here. 184. No, that's not it either. Is it raining outside? I just got a notification it was raining, which makes me happy. I love rain. I really, really do. 186. 100 and... Okay. Hmm. It's gonna go up more. Yeah, let's go up more. How do you know what the number you're looking for is? I, I'm guessing like zero, you know? 
You should walk to the other side of the moon to meet the Transformers. <laughs> I hate the fact that I know what you're talking about. Too. Okay. Yeah. All right. 22. Okay. So what do astronauts do? They like weigh the gravity? Nine. It's getting close now. Ten. Okay, we're close. Ten. Still ten, huh? Still north, maybe? We go, gotta go down. Oh, it's right here. It's right here, dude. Is this what we're looking for? That's it. I mean, that's it, right? You want a negative. Is that it? The lander went down when you were at 600. So me going north is bad. So I want to go down instead. Okay, yeah. I'll try. Just keep going north, Joel. Okay. Hmm. Do you guys remember that movie Mission to Mars? Was that any good? Oh, I remember there was an alien at the end of that. So. Okay, it was alright. I rewatched Contact with Judy Foster recently, and I, I gotta say, um, it was so fucking distracting because Gary Busey's son uh, is a Christian terrorist in that movie. And I kept fucking laughing about it because I'm like, what? He's a Christian terrorist that wants to blow up. Uh, <laughs> wants to blow up this giant alien device. Yeah, Gary Busey's uh, kid is in the movie. He plays a Christian terrorist. Okay. The book is far better. The entire thing raised very good points about life and space. Yeah, I, I, I read that mo that book too, and all I got from the book was, "Damn, how tight is that alien onus?" You know. And then they kicked me out of the book club. So another point in the in the book that I read too. It was more so like that I can't read. But the pictures on the front was funny. <laughs> okay. I checked and it's literally just go straight up until you find something. Okay, okay, if you say so. So disturbing thought to be alone on the moon, you know. Joel, why are you always thinking about sex stuff? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Did that upset you? I, I, I won't do it anymore. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. No, I won't do it anymore. Joey, ew, ew. Okay. Joe, you have made a mortgage joke in the last two minutes. Please do another. No, those will cost money. I don't do requests. We're almost back to where we were, but we have to just go north. We just have to keep going north. Okay. When Chad's hours from now, Joel? Uh, well... 
we'll see you. Okay. It's gonna be rocks, I'm gonna go north then. Okay, yeah. Chad Towers. Eventually gonna wrap around the moon. <laughs> wrap around the moon. How long would it take to like walk around the moon? But you want to be able to walk around the moon anyway, because one of the one of the like when daylight or the sun is directly coming on the moon, it's hot as hell, you know. The gravity is the same here. Okay. I mean, keep going north, I suppose. That's what chat's telling me. Several people are saying so, by the way. And I would walk 100 miles. Uh, you guys ever seen the clip of that Swedish guy that throws a axe spray into a fireplace when they're all drunk? And at times, just when the chorus or the verse hits of that song, because they're playing in the background, it's hysterical. They threw an axe like like the deodorant. <sighs> okay. Now I can fucking find it. No. It's the worst thing I've ever heard. It's not the version I want. Okay. <laughs> Found it. Fire. Well, that's the video. Oh, chat's telling me to go north still. <sighs> I'm gonna say fuck what chat's saying and I'm gonna do this my own way because I don't believe that it's gonna go north. I'm gonna go the opposite way instead. Okay. His whole point was like the guy crashed when it was like minus 600, right? Hmm. Oh, the moon. I kind of want to see that uh, Roland Emmerich movie, The the Moonfall, you know. I want to do it just to edit in Majora's Mask music in it. Ha 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 ha. Oh my god, does this game ever fucking go somewhere? Please. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I shouldn't lash out like that, but fuck. <sighs> Joel being rude. He hates it. Sort of. Um, yeah. 
Boring stream. <laughs> Boring stream. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's nothing going on here, I'll tell you that. Um... Well, I'll say this, I'll say this. We might have to, like, resume this game at some other point, because, like, I'm out of time. I'm out of time by an hour. I'm over time by an hour, so... We might have to just resume this at another point, because, like, I... I can't figure this out. You know? I don't know. I'm out of touch. I'm out of time. I'm stuck on the moon, and I'm... board okay well i'm gonna call it here for this game uh i couldn't figure this out sorry uh but we'll assume it next time i guess it's the dread x collection 2 uh interesting game but just like i don't know what happened uh, it's just i just can't get to the end you know but uh yeah i mean i guess walking on the moon is an isolating experience in itself but uh all right guys that's gonna be the dread x collection collection part one uh you know, uh, what can I say about it, except my favorite was definitely the Squirrel Stapler game. I mean, it was just so off the rails, but I also enjoyed uh, Torbus game. Like, the the game was pretty solid, you know. It was, it was very, very silly, but at the same time, meh, you know. But guys, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be a five-plus-hour stream for charity. Hope you enjoyed Varg verse and i will catch you tomorrow uh when the same time i started today 11 p.m est time uh tomorrow is going to be something different but i highly encourage you to ch join in and check that out uh tomorrow in fact we have some multiplayer blocks as well and on uh monday monday Vinny is going to do something exciting for you guys too so, uh, yes, there we go, everybody. I'm not going to do the art tonight because I'm way over time, but uh, I'm going to say thank you for joining in. Thank you to Jerma for hosting earlier. And if you stuck around from Jerma, uh, uh, leave. Get fuck out of here. Leave. Shoo. Leave. Shoo with you. Go to another tab. Go to another tab. Click on the other tab. <laughs> Shoo, shoo, shoo. <laughs> I'm leaving and I'm taking the kids too. Anyway, no, but seriously, thanks for sticking around, guys. And thank you to everybody who could donate to the direct relief for the, the charity here. If you're unaware, if you're just tuning in, like, oh, it's a charity stream. Well, we weren't, we weren't necessarily doing it like as hardcore as we're doing it on the Varieties Hope, for example. But, uh, you know, I, I, it's fun to do this format, too, because, um, you know, I can stream the times, the schedule we have now. I don't have a s super set time when we end, but, uh, you know, but uh, so far, so far, um, let's see how much we raised, everybody. We have raised 24000 for uh, direct relief towards... Uh, Ukraine for humanitarian aid, you know, as I said before, it's not going to any, like, more weaponry stuff, it's it's going just for people that, you know, want to escape the country and going towards, you know, food and medicine for people affected by this, so, you know, so, uh, yeah, but uh, it's always, it's always great to do a little charity streams and, you know, do something good, so, you know what, anyway, I'll see you soon, guys, everybody, uh, thank you for watching, uh, Varg Verse is amazing, check that game out, too, it's a, it's a, it's a bop, you know, uh, anyway, I'll see you soon, everybody, uh, see you tomorrow, but for now, I'm gonna say, uh, check out the rest of the streamers, I know that, uh, hang on, was anybody live after me, I think everybody's just gone to sleep at this point, it's very late, uh, hmm, <laughs> well i'll say this i'll say this maybe hang on wait okay gearmatic was probably going to stream but he's not so i'm going to say this thank you for watching uh i'll be back tomorrow with more stuff for now thank you for watching tip of the day is you should 
make a sandwich in the fridge uh, because who wants to make sandwiches? It's better to make them sometime. This turn got Dr. Steve rule tip. Fuck. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, okay, better, better. Uh, how about this? How about this? Did you know that you could go to the public library and print out anything you want for free? That's right. I think that's how it works in America. Maybe, maybe not. Too. So I'm saying, I'm you can you can do that. You can do that in the uh, library. I said library, okay. Oh, they charge for that shit in America. Oh god damn, I was gonna say. Well, guys, you know what you could do? You could print out some crafts from the internet and make like a box Mario. They monetized that a while ago. God damn it. Okay, well, I'm sorry. Uh, maybe not that's good a tip then. Uh, how about how about this then? Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh. Are you around that like 20 year old, 25 year old range and you go to college? Well, guess what you could do? You could go to your school and the college and go to the uh, printers and print out a boxy Mario. That's right. And it's for free. Like you could make. They charge for that too. They do not charge at school for that. See, I'm talking about. You can make a Mario. <laughs> you can't do that. What? Okay. Then fuck it. Tip of the day is... Get a printer. They can do that stuff. <laughs> okay, thanks. Uh, <laughs> what a bad tip. Anyway, guys. I'll be back tomorrow with more stuff. Thank you for watching and thank you for donating. I'll see you soon. And enjoy one of my followers. Follow on my follow list. Right now. Who is live? Who is live? Uh, da, 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 dun, dun, dun. Well, you know what? You know what? You know what? You know what? Let's see here. Great Sphinx is live. Is he? Well, I guess we're doing that. All right, I'm gonna host Great Sphinx. See you soon. Thanks for watching. And uh, God bless. And all that shit, right? Hmm? Alright, peace out.